love Robin Hill's pigeon. You do? You want to go somewhere? Yeah. Pigeon's old stomping grounds. Woo! This is the ocean right there. You can see it in the background. And we're going to teach you how to skate downhill. When I count the paper, surely I'm not in them. I don't want to be a part of something so deceiving. You're just on a sidewalk and you don't have room to carve you can go backwards straight down any hill any steepness and you'll be fine this is a perfect spot yeah to practice going down your toe stops so if you're practicing going down your toe stops for the first time a handrail is really useful to get comfortable lunging deep and gradually applying pressure to your toe stops so that you don't topple backwards. Yeah, let's do it. too fast. 
toast, you can turn around and toast off. So watch me do it super quick. Just a couple feet and I'm stopped. Yeah. If you're a beginner, we'll give you a video in the future really breaking down how to do the turnaround toast stop. But right now, since this is an advanced tutorial for people that are ready to bomb hills, we're just gonna keep on with it. Yeah, you're ready to learn how to carve. Carving is going forward and using your edges to control your speed. You wanna start on an easy hill without any cars. The less traffic, the better. The wider, the better, and the more mellow the hill, the better. Whenever you approach the hill, you never want to go straight down. You wanna carve back and forth perpendicular to the slope of the hill. When you wanna start carving, if you're gonna start turning to the right, you put your right foot forward, and when you turn to the left, you put your left foot forward. But that's not it. Your back leg plays a big role in carving. When you are carving, you're gonna push out with your back leg, and that's gonna create friction that causes you to slow down a little bit to control your speed. It's also very important to move with your shoulders and look. If you're keeping your body facing forward and you're just trying to move your feet to turn, it's way more difficult than if you where your head and your shoulders go, your body will follow. If you ever feel like you're going too fast, just keep going up the hill. Make a big smiley face and you end up stopping. And then you keep going. Up, oh, going too fast. Gonna go up the hill a little bit, slow myself down, and start again. And then when I'm turning this way, I feel the weight on these edges. You don't actually pick up the wheels. I'm just showing you where the weight would be distributed. <laughs> Okay, so where are we, Bijan? We are at UC Santa Cruz, my alma mater, University of California. Uh, it's a school. We're at school. Uh, my stats, when I left Santa Cruz to move to Long Beach, I had 33 worn down toe stop butts. I thought I'd save them for an art project. I had over $1,000 in ro roller skating tickets. She's not supposed to skate on campus. And one set of really worn down outdoor wheels. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> what wheels do you recommend for outdoor skating on rough surfaces? Um, like a good rough surface wheel would be a softer wheel. It absorbs all the bumps and a smoother ride. Less likely that you'll you'll fall. You'll go a little bit slower. On the flip side, if you have a really really smooth surface, you want a harder wheel because cool. that'll give you more speed and control over a softer wheel. These roads are really good to learn on because they're super shallow. They're not too steep of hills. They're smooth. They're wide and there's not a lot of traffic.
seen on campus. And that professor was like, cop, you should give them a ticket. That was crazy. Oh, that was so good. I was like crying. Y'all good, Enzo? Yay, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Planet Roller Skate. We hope you are now prepared to go downhills. If you have any questions, just ask us in the comments. We'll do our best to answer them. Until then, later, later skaters! skaters. Let them pass so that we are safe all the time and then we can start shredding again like right now